Hello, welcome back to Cult of the Resurrection. We are just about to explore down into this well to find where this underwater passage will take us. Uh, it takes us to a locked grill. Well, that's not very promising. Can I switch? Not what I can see. Uh, Oh, uh, that was a quick diversion. I guess we're not coming. I guess we're not getting in that way. All right. So we have got caves. Uh, I guess that's the waterways. Maybe we could have found a way into the waterways from uh, further back. I guess we are having to go back through the caves with the zombies after all. Don't really see I've got much other choice. I just gone there and uh, heard the zombies and thought, well, maybe I'll try the other way, but the other way appears to be a dead end. So, this end. That was an undead end. Ah, I messed up the joke. That's a dead end. This is an undead end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good joke. Good joke. Uh, I don't see a ladder. If I drop down here. I'm not getting back up again. The nearest wooden beam is there, which is a long way too far away for a repair. Um, once again, I'm convinced about proceeding that way. Especially because I don't really know. I mean, I've got to find all the cult members in the Spirit Stone, and that's really. Or I've got to get back out of the fortress and into the sewers with life on them intact. So, really, we're supposed to be at the fortress, right? And not at that undead area? I should probably go downstairs and go back here before I go. Wait. I can't do a walk there. Garrett. Garrett! Oh, he's stuck in the ground again. Not the first time on this mission. Alright. Where's the lift buttons? What? What do you mean there are no lift buttons? I'm gonna, gonna go back to that garden area or so. Oh well! This mission seems to have a lot of unfortunate dead ends in it. Uh, well, I guess I'm going this way, even if I can't get back. I've got one moss arrow. I don't really want to waste it just to make this fall a little quieter. So, let's go down and see what we've got. Zombies. Several of them. Great. Just what I need when I'm low on health. Um, yeah, stop. You'll see me, aren't Music. Oh, great, I can reach these ones. Well, I somehow managed to do that without killing myself. That's uh, good news. Probably worth a save, to be honest. Used up both my uh, fire arrows, but uh, I didn't really have another use for them, to be honest. Right. Uh, this looks like the same fortressy area that I was trying, just trying to get back to for the five lifts, so that's alright. Um, here we have a very dramatic room. This body, it be dead and cold. Mine arms, leaden with the hard earth, and my, uh, mine eyes, they have turned from the light. Well, there is no body. Full of water. There's a little pit. Which I can drop a rock into. Or three. There's a 
torch, I could uh, light with a fire arrow. Hmm. Hmm. It's clearly puzzled to open this. I don't know what it means. And I have no fire arrows anyway. That door doesn't open. I guess we're going this way after all. You're not one of us! How did you see me there? <sighs> What's it say? When I find the chambers you, of rats. Oh, he's coming for me. Oh wait, this is just where I was. Well, I'm going to wait here till you've calmed down, sir. Why don't you come back and calm down? <laughs> Went all the way around up there. Let's explore that room. I'm not there. I'll find you eventually. I don't think so. There's that fellow drawing up there. This way, right? Ooh. More equipment. I won't say no. What do we have in these chests? A rotted head, how nice. Uh, I'm not quite sure why I picked that up. Must be important. Decayed torso! I'm collecting some lovely bits of somebody. Just what I needed. So there's an artifact friend back there patrolling in the garden. Sounds like it's yes. Oh, he comes in here. No! How did you see me? You are like have pretty natural eyesight, sir. So you're quite quiet now. Why did your sound stop? Where's he going? With the sound, right? So is that not our garden patrol, friend? Is that someone else? Or does he go in there and come back out and then go around the garden? I don't know. And they're very quick on the draw with their bows, and uh, oh, here he comes. And I tend to be a little. Harder hitting than I like. Ow! Turn around! You couldn't see me! How dare you! How dare you, sir! That hurt. I'm sneaking up behind you and you turn around as if you magically knew I was there. That's not really quite fair. Oh well. I can only hope for, to find another healing potion somewhere. What have we got in this well? Oh, what arrow. Mm. Not really what I need. Hmm. It's quiet now. Oh, is there somebody in the alcove? Or is he up there looking out the window? Well, there's more than one. Oh, I know this. Go away. Hmm. Sit right there, Garrett. Huh? Did I just see a 
mostly dead and ran away before I could finish him off and someone else saw me so I didn't feel like I could chase him you, I'll find you eventually just poke your head out I'll end it for you quick like and they're all on my tail with their eyes open there's trouble where did he go damn it he's not here lost him couldn't possibly be standing in this dark shadow you can't hide forever as soon as I find you uh, it's just looking bad. We're gonna have fun gutting you. Heads up. We got an intruder. Alright, maybe they're not going this way. You can't hide forever. We're gonna have fun gutting you, boy. Cutting you and smearing myself through your entrails was, I think, my objective. Come on out and play. Not the other way around. Come on, guys, give up already. He's long gone. I'll find you eventually. Well, anyway, so I've got at least three. Oh, there they go. At least three cultists left to disembowel. I'm pretty sure I heard someone sighing behind that door there. Plus, there's the leaders. I don't think I've found either of the leaders yet. And here I am. Oh, two hit points. Almost dead. So, if nothing else, I know why Garrett is a thief and not an assassin. How many guards do they have in here, anyway? Too many? Okay, that's, that's stone. What's this say? Tarex! My sick friend, how do you fare? How fortunate you, how fortunate you were not to accompany it. How fortunate you were not to accompany us on the raid to that fiendish hammer cathedral. Simply residing back beneath another one is enough to make my skin crawl. Indeed, I am thankful that our Lady Katrina had discovered this refuge, but its nature makes me a bit bespelled in lieu of recent events. We began this plan, sneaking around and losing arrows into the guards, bef losing arrows into the guards before jumping the gate. Once inside, it was indeed the trickster himself that broke loose. What magics did I spy, and not just from the hammers? The old priests discovered us. I'd be sure they did launch the Builder's Flame at us, but so did our own Rathus launch twice Hellfire back. I had heard stories, and now I may say, he is indeed the pupil of Azaran, as was rumoured. But at what cost? In the fiery attack, as we grabbed and looted, slashing at the Deviant Hammers, I saw the Necromancer take a blow, and that mask he always wears was knocked all but loose, and what horror it did reveal. I know that the old wizard experiments with his dead things and dark powers, but I had no idea he had such need of his mask. For it appears he hath discovered the secrets of life, or death. His flesh appeared grim and pasty, as if it were all but rotted off. After his battle with the wizard, I saw him take an arrow in the chest, and he plucked it out as if it were nothing. I shiver to think he sleeps just neath us at night. By the gods, Tarax, I know not what manner of man he is. Perhaps he is not alive at all, but lives on in death as a walking corpse. I think I even heard Thulus mention some moons ago that his real soul... body? died long ago. They must pay the good captain well if he knows the truth so deeply. I, for one, am not sh not sure I am so willing to stay amidst such abominations. I joined the resurrection to thieve and plunder, and not fall victim to some devilish arcane power. But you know what they say, no one ever quits the cult. We may be trapped here, my friend. I will be gone these next few nights on further assignment, but I leave this to you as a warning. Keep your eyes open. Perhaps we can discover more about what Katrina is really up to. Why she so desperately needs Rathus and what the hell she is doing with that bloody body in the basement. But be well, Brother Tarax, and this time, don't leave my letter where someone can spy it, you tapper. Angus. Yeah, looked, you didn't listen, did he? Alright, uh, to answer your question, Garrett, how many guards have they got in here? The answer is two. The question in my head is, can I... <coughs> Sounded funny. Yeah, no shit. Oh. 
Uh, maybe I should go for arrows first, yeah? Probably more effective. Yeah, a little more effective, alright. Ah, oh, somebody heard me. Oh, oops. I tweaked the, uh... But, oh, two mines. There's somebody running around there. And some more dramatic chords. They're just patrolling a lot in here. You won't stay hidden for long, Taffer. So he's indeed Don't wrong you there. move a muscle. Scared, huh? Guards, yep. over here! That's right, you run away. Find some more guards. To help you out. In the meantime. Over here. More basement? Or is the same basement that I was at before? Ooh. So it's another place entirely. You got any idea what we do to unwelcome guests? Whoa! There's more people down there. They're aware of me. <laughs> All right, then. That's a good, nice corner save. We still got people in the gardens to worry about, or rather, people overlooking the gardens. Uh, I think that's one of them. I think he knows I'm here. This is not good news for me. Don't make me come find you. Oh no, he's running back to the other room. Where the where I saw the other guard. Okay, that's fine. I think there's a second one running around. If they don't know I'm here, that's that's good. Good news for me at any rate. Oh, he's still patrolling. Somebody's still up in that window. Yeah, there goes the other guy. He's the one I actually ran into. So he got a friend to go help him there. Good. I mean, sort of good. Good they're not coming for me. Bad that I still have yet to uh, deal with them. I'm going to take this opportunity. I've got lots of water arrows. I haven't really been using them. To create a little more darkness in here. So I can sneak up on them a little better. There's not much darkness. I wonder if I should also do that last torch there. Yes. Well, there's our twitchy uh, friend in the garden, right? Yeah, he's our twitchy patroller. Oh, that was he was a Twitchy Patrol. Oh, I'm confused. Who's. Where are all these guards coming from and where are they all going to? I don't know. Oh, there's too many of them for my liking. And they're still getting excited. So, what am I supposed to do? Go after this one? Go after that one fellow? The one who was running away from me before. Hey! Right there, Garrett. Ah! Open your dead. Run. 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 Come on. Come on. After him. Okay, now what? That's it. You it. Run. I don't know where I'm running to. Can I jump on the tree? I can. 
I think I find me. I know, but oh, he lost me. I know you're around here somewhere. Oh, good, I got into a dark spot before the archer arrived. Oh, he can still see me. We're gonna have fun gutting you, boy. But the archer can't. I know you're out there. There's a stranger causing trouble. Any idea what Keep your eyes peeled. <sighs> At least four of them now running right here, and I don't know about the other two oh, down there. No, come on. One of them is dressed differently, and I think he might be one of the leaders. I'm just worried about the archer. The other guys don't bother me. I can escape. Don't yours. start thinking I'm gonna forget about you. Well, I am kind of thinking that, you know. I'm very much hoping that. Hmm. If you forget about me, then my, most of my problems are gone. Got a lot of broadheads, but while they're busy searching for me, you'll come use up too many. Wherever you are. Heads up. We got an intruder. Someone else running around. <coughs> As you can see, I don't have quite enough arrows to uh, thinking I'm gonna deal with them you. all from distance. We though. have an intruder! Yeah, we know. Oh! Alright, Archer is dead. The main, main problem is dead. Now, the other guys decided to run away for change, and. Oh dear. Which is a problem for me. But if I just sit here and wait for them all to calm down a little more, then maybe I can get back Garrett! on track. It's Garrett! Get him! God damn it. Alright. Oh dear. Hello there. Did you see me? Very slowly. God damn it. They're everywhere. And I'm almost dead. I could use mines. Help! Save me! There's someone here. Well, he doesn't sound like a threat. I could throw bits of dead roughy I'll body. You. Damn you. I'm, best, I'm guessing these bits of body is like Rathus's old body and uh, if I use them at that room and do whatever arcane ritual it kind of wants me to do then that'll be the secret to defeat him or something like that that's my guess ah oh, they're still hunting god they're also nervous Also, it's got to the point that I don't even know where they normally hang out now, and how many of them are going to go back to their... How many of them are going to go back to their starting positions? He's still hunting me in there. I don't know what happens to the people who run off that way, but I haven't seen them come back yet. They might still be stuck there. Someone else saw something. Don't, don't know where or who. Where? Can you see me? You didn't see me, right? Alrighty, let's assume... Oh, hello. He's not... No, oh, he's turned around, alright. Let's assume that the people who chased me in here have given up for now. No, that's a bad assumption. They were still hunting! All the way over there, what the hell? That was like 10 minutes ago. He 
you see me? What do you see me over there? Ah, oh, here, here comes everyone again to party. Great. Alright, I think it's time... At least one mine, right? Do I have a noisemaker? Can I get them all? Can I get a bunch of them running to a noisemaker and then get them to stand on a mine? We're gonna have fun gutting you, boy. Let's try it. Where did that go? Bounced off the wall, I think. Wherever you are. That's not where I wanted to go. Can't rely on to get a mine over there. Come on out and play. Let's try the other noisemaker. It's more like it. Come on, two of you, two of you. I don't want to waste my mines. I've got too many guards. There's two, only two mines. Go on over there. Join him. When I find you, I'm gonna take my time with you. All right, well, while you're doing that, let's see if I can get this guy's head. Oh, it's in his head, but he's down. All right. When I find you, I'm gonna take my time with you. You got an intruder. Well, hit one of them. You better hope I find you before the guards do. Oh, he's an archer too. I don't want him. All right, two more down. Good. These guys are still quite angry, but there's less of them now. Three more down. I'll find you eventually. There's at least three more people there. One of them sounded civilian. As soon as I find you, you're dead. What if you don't find me, though? Did he just say, get him? Did he just see me again? I think he saw me. Yep, he saw me. Both saw me. Back to my tree! Oh, no. ah! Or not. I was saving my, my tree, but they are very quick with their swords and uh, chopped my legs off as I was climbing up there. Not really uh, what I wanted, so I guess I'm going to have to wait. It's a problem with getting everyone really highly alerted as they take forever to calm down and then they're nervous and twitchy for the rest of the mission. Can't hide forever. Never really calm down properly. Yeah. But I can hide forever, just you wait. you searched that room 20 times already. He's not in there. I'll find you eventually. Come on, you can give up. It's alright to give up. It's okay to admit you've been beaten. Not that I ever would. There you are. See? All back to normal. Now, it's nice and dark over here. Can I see one of them? Can I get him with my bow from this distance? Really good question. I used to be very good with the bow, but it's been a long time since I've played with the primarily. No, I missed. Primarily, kind of killing people from distance tactic. Take my nose maker though. So I really don't remember what the angles and ranges are kind of like anymore. I wasn't ahead. <gasps> Why are they going through that door? Does that lead down here? I guess it does. He's dead. Come back out here, you tap. We're gonna have fun. Ah! Alright, one more down. The other I'll one injured. Find you eventually. Yeah, that's the plan. Alright, let me see if I can get him with my sword. Guards! Over here! No, he's running away. God, there's a lot of these guys here. 
We have an intruder! Yeah? Someone else in there. I heard some footsteps and decided not to hang around, but uh, sound propagation means I can't hear them. Where are you? Where are you hiding? What's on the ceiling? Dinner. <laughs> he appears to be shouting for more guards <laughs> and having fewer guards actually coming to help him. Maybe I just need to come deal with him. I see a note on the table there. Over here. I haven't read that. Hmm? Ah! Ah! Oh, I haven't even checked that room yet. All right. What have I? No, that's all new to me. There's a gong. All right. We'll check there in a minute. First, let's read this note. Katrina has asked me to remind you all to remain at your posts and keep alert for the duration of the week. We don't need anyone wandering around the forbidden areas of the fortress, and we certainly don't want any more casualties. My chambers, as well as the good ladies, are forbidden to everyone, and the lower depths are forbidden to all but senior members of the Resurrection. The Holy Sword of St. Edgar is to remain protected, as it is a valuable artifact, and any attempts to get creative with your weaponry and retreat it from its resting place will be met with severe punishment. We cannot afford to have unrest within the circle. Captain Thulis. Well, I'm going to be exploring all your uh, quarters. Well, nobody's been pooping diamonds in there. So let me start with this room. Ah, oh, it's the kitchens. I might get some hit points back if I'm lucky. Uh, not the spoons. Where's that bread gone? Nope. I didn't want to throw away the rotted head. I wanted to eat. And not the rotted leg. I wanted to eat the deer leg. Yes. Oh, no hit points there. Oh, door that wasn't opening. There we are. Do you count as a cultist? Hey, there's a guy oh, with yeah, a bow! Oh, yeah! There's a sword! Help me! You're a cultist. You're just unarmed, right? Oh well, let him run. No food! I need to eat all the food. I must go with me. Oh, more food in the oven? Nope. Also, no good for me. Honestly, what's to say? To all staff, in light of recent events, all precious dinnerware is to be kept hidden in its intended niche. I do believe it was that incompetent, ignorant Bluth who tried to take our goods, as he also tried to sneak into my chambers. I caught the full red-handed snooping around my fireplace. Consequently, he is now out of the loop, so to speak. However, I feel we should continue to hide the goods as a precautionary measure. We don't want our resources being stolen from ourselves, do we? And make sure the kitchen remains clean. The last few times they have been present, the place has been rank. All trash is to be taken to the incinerator immediately. Lady Katrina. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course I've got a sword. I'm a master assassin! Would you believe? Well, that's all non-valuable. Glassware. Wonder what's behind here, huh? Oh look, it's all the valuable! 
Yay. Very well hidden there. Didn't want anybody stealing that, would you? No. Yes, there's somebody in there. Oh, there's a pit. Interesting. I don't think I want to fall down there. Doesn't look comfortable. Alright. Actually, let's go back through the dining room. Oh no, there's no other door. That's an odd place to keep a dining room. You have to go through the kitchen to get there. Help! Thief! Thief! Yep. Run away again. See, I don't know if I have to kill them. And seeing as they're unarmed, I will avoid killing them. Unless the objective requires it. Ah, I've been here. This is the door that was guarded by one of those fine fellows I was trying to kill earlier. I expect that's a Lady Katrina's chambers there. That I'm gonna need a key for. Alright, so this connects back to the garden. We have our tremulous fellows up there wandering around. It's this way. Also a key needed, right? Do you mind? Oh god, now I'm stuck too. There's a guy over here! Help you? me! You okay there? Help! Thank you. Thief! Thief! What do we got here? Apple! Nope, no healing. Let me eat. Uh, alright. Spiral stairs. Oh, this is the basement where I found the body bits. And I missed this chest. I bet there's another bit of a body in here. What do you reckon? Skeletal arm. Okay, three pieces of body. Maybe under the stairs. Nope. Okay then. More broadheads. That will be handy. Unlock the door. Katrina's chambers or Rathus's? I don't know. Maybe this note will tell us. Captain Thulos, I should not need to remind you that my quarters are private and are to remain private except in the most dire circumstances. Aside from my personal guard, Robert, who is allowed in my chambers at all times, you are in possession of the only key. You are not to entrust this key to anyone. You were chosen because you were believed to have the ability to protect it. This most recent incident has left us one less member and I dare say we cannot afford to have any more corpses littering my floor. Warn your men if need be, but I am not to be disturbed, especially at night. This is indeed Captain Thulis's chamber, and he has the key to what well, must be Katrina's room. There's double doors down there. Alright. Let's see what else he's got. Healing potion, please. Keep a healing potion in your chest. Just for me. Or two, or three. I'll happily take three healing potions. Ah, that's red barrows. Oh, looks. Alright, I'll just take your money instead. Sigh. I'm throw your goods around out of spite. Alright, Captain Thulis. Uh, well, the key you gave me is helpful as well. Is that you? I don't know. Here, over here, here's the sword! Help! Alright, let's leave him in the kitchen. Let's come back. This way. So this will be Lady Katrina's cha chambers, no doubt. No? Alright. Where was the other door that I couldn't unlock? It was up here. Hello again. Help! Save me! This one. Yes, okay. 
And that leaves him to wander around again. Oh. Is someone there? Oh, bollocks. Did you see that? An archer. And too much light. And that helped not at all. I don't know my mines anymore. I did get my nose makers back. <coughs> but really, I shouldn't use them if I don't need them, right? Yeah, anywhere dark to stand? No? Box. <coughs> Clearly somebody important, they look quite different. <coughs> oh, that didn't get him. Go back. Fine, sir. Save me! There's someone here! Hello! I saw someone just a minute back. Oh, come now. <coughs> Why don't you take him back to where you saw them? Help! Help! I should have locked the door behind me. Little, uh... They can ruin everything. Stop hunting. Or not. Well, that does make it dark. <coughs> dark enough. Is this a thief? <gasps> Three fire arrows in his belt. Uh, I wonder if he shoots fire arrows. Well, I'm very glad not to have found out if he does. Or at least not to have found out the hard way. I'll take your loot. And your potted plant. Oh look! He has the eye. Somewhat valuable trinket. <laughs> nice. Uh, not valuable. What's in here? Come on, come on. Uh, I'll make it so complicated. Everybody in this game makes loot too hard to steal. Oh, it's Katrina's diary. What is? What does it say? I begin my diary today, as today marks the beginning. As planned, that old fool has fallen victim to my charms. Such a wonderfully helpful little man he has been. So willing to help a beautiful young girl fraught with sin. But I shall show him the true meaning of the word, for here within this temple lies the key to my power. Things are still going smoothly, albeit slowly. I have thus taken plans to send word to Rathus to enlist his aid. With the chance to experiment on his playthings away from his master, I'm sure he will not refuse. I am beginning to fear the lesser acolytes suspect something. That one Marcus, he does eye me strangely. And who wouldn't, knowing that I'm going to and from his precious, pure master's bedchamber at all hours of the night? How sweet it is to be the seed of corruption. He has agreed. Rathus, being released from his tower, is to meet me here shortly. Having no Ithestash's initial payment, I was forced to hide the diamonds within the temple itself. But no matter. Upon his arrival, provided I am finished with the old priest, we may, be, we may dispose of the goodly builder's servants and commence our plan. Rathus has arrived, but remains impatient. He must hide in the surrounding town until this has passed. And where has that blasted Marcus gone? It is done. The old fool has told me the location of the key and has now outlived his usefulness. I can feel his power surging from below. The precious hammers knew they could not destroy him, and it will be their undoing. I now hold the key to his return, and with it shall the resurrection be forged. In our darkest hour, our greatest triumph is at hand. That bloody fool Marcus has brought the hammers upon us, and after killing the old priest and his tough acolyte Joseph, we will met with a whole brigade of hammer warriors. Our magics, however strong, were not enough to fend them off. But Rathus has proved useful indeed, for with a little trickery, the hammers now believe us to be dead, while we hide safely in the basement. 
What fair fortune, the hammers have sealed off this part of the city, condemning it, and the city council has agreed. Now Rathus and I can continue our work in secret. We have already begun to recruit members into our order. It shall be done. How I feel his power surge within me. The time of his coming is at hand, and the hammers still have no idea we exist. We are now almost 30 strong and have successfully procured the items we need. Thieves, ironically, make the most loyal members, and most of the fools have no idea of the scope of their actions. And with the Spirit Stone, one of the last artifacts we need, he shall be among us soon. Alright, well, uh, I'm not sure that gives me much useful information, but that's uh, the gist of their plans. What else is in your quarters here, Katrina? So that must mean, what is his name, Robert or something? Katrina's personal guard? And uh, the harpist is still playing dramatically over there. Now, she clearly has a secret inner fireplace, as the other note mentioned. And this is also plainly visible. But let's take... I don't want your bottles, I want your loot, I want your food. I don't want your... Uh, trays either. My oh, food is doing me no good, it's a shame. What else is in your chambers here? Oh, way downstairs to... Oh! Just the basement proper. Hmm. Bones. I... fear I might have to come back here and explore a bit. I want to finish exploring the chambers up here first. See what else I can find. First there's a secret passage. Secondly there's this door. Now this just goes to a little garden with a pick and another rope arrow. That's a lot of rope arrows considering how little the use there is for them generally in this level. Alright. We still have those two noisy nuisances out there running around. I, although maybe they're back in the kitchen by now. Yeah, they're walking around in the kitchen. We'll leave them to their business. I'm going to investigate the secret passage. Ah, well that's just loot, it's not a passage, but that's alright. I'll take it. How are we doing? I've got my loot objective. I still need to find the, and steal the spirit stone. I still need to figure out what's up with this body parts and uh, that chamber out there. I don't know, maybe I'll find more information on that downstairs. Uh, so let's take a quick hard save here because I haven't done this since the start of the mission. And let's explore this basement area. Weird, because there's like a, the whole place is a basement, so there's like the basement of a basement. I guess that makes it technically a sub basement, but yeah. Ah! Interesting. Let's pull the water out, there's another passageway that's locked. Aha! Lady Katrina? Is that you? Dead now. This is just your bath. Do you have any keys on you? Don't think so. No. Alright, well. Maybe you drowned in the bath. Okay, so this is the one I heard singing, but this is not. Oh, key. Chapel key. Nice. This is not the room that I was hearing the singing from, which had double doors. It was upstairs. Now is this the key? No, I can pick this lock. I'll come back here. I'm going to run back to those other double doors. See if that is where this chapel key is for, because... I'm a little confused as to what's where and why and all that. And honestly, I should just deal with these uh, kitchen fools right away, because I'm sure they're on the list of cultists. Oh. 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 Ah. One. The other one's still running around yelling. Is it in 
here. Hello there. Sorry, problem solved. More cultists dead, so if we come down here. Where's my chapel key? Is this the key I need for this door? It is indeed. So where is this? And where does it go? And why did I think the singing was coming from behind here? And how does this go to somewhere different than the ladies' bath chamber? So many questions. All right, which way do I go? West or south? Let's try west. Stairs. All right, okay. There's my answer. That goes up to her. I could hear her singing reverberating down through here. Uh, okay. So, I guess this is going to be an important place. I have a bad feeling about this. As well you might. Make it safe. New objectives. What do we got? You don't want Constantine coming back. Find a way to dispose of his body permanently. Is that Constantine's body up there? Dropping him in the water isn't going to do it, right? Well, we've got the spirit stone. That's uh, objective done. Does that light up? Hmm? Yeah, I can carry that. All right. Um, let's drop him in the water, right? That'll be enough. No? It's not enough to dispose of him. All right. Yeah. Oh, what's that say? Here lieth our master to be returned unto us. Well, hopefully not to be returned unto you. Is there anything else in this room that I'm missing? No, right. Come on. Come on, Mr. Corpse. Funny, I still don't think I found the necromancer dude. Maybe he's in the water tunnels that I couldn't really get at. So, oh, where was that? Where was that room? Mystical room. It was upstairs, wasn't it? Maybe I should just drop you down the uh, into the kitchen. Uh, where are we? So go up or down? Uh, yeah, let's take the lift foot back up again. Before I do, let me reorient myself. Right. Okay. Oh, the kitchen's this way. Let's not take the lift up then. What's instead? Why don't we try throwing this fella down that pit in the kitchen, right? Burning him up, that should do the job. Oh, that's not the kitchen. Oh, that is heavy. Stop being so heavy. The kitchen is there. Alright, I'm at the back of the kitchen. This way. I believe it was. No, that's just the pantry. Ah, uh, this way, and past the dining room. Well, there's some kind of machinery and a pit of lava, or at least very hot fire at the bottom. That should do it, right? He's only, it's only the body mummified corpse of he a pagan god. Surely. Surely that'll suffice. No? Oh yeah. He's gone. Yes. Alright. Ah. Didn't think it'd be that easy just by burning his body, but okay. Alright, still haven't killed all cult members, uh, so there's still someone around somewhere. It's bad news for me because I don't know where they would be. 
Also, I'm still running low on health. Um, but and there's something happened. Something in here, right? Oh, that's the undead. Oh, this room. What does it say? This body, it be dead and cold. My arms leaden with the hard earth, and my eyes they have turned from the light. with all this body parts I've got. It's kind of weird. Maybe if I put the trickster's body here and did this ritual, he would come back to life. That would be quite amusing if so. Let's light your torch and see what happens. What? No. I bumped a skip. Well, nothing. I'm sure something's supposed to happen. I don't know what. Wait, why has, uh... Why do I start hearing erupting volcano noises? Uh, right, so... Go back here. This leads... On the one hand, that way led to the undead. This way led to a well, which I don't believe I could get past. So, if the old necromancer is still there in the water tunnel, this must be a back way into the entire complex. Because um, I certainly couldn't open it from this side. So, oh god, yeah, I forgot about that. Um, I forgot there was no way to uh, send the lift down once you're up on it. That's pretty big oversight from the uh, people who installed the lift, the manufacturers there. I think I might uh, have to send them a complaint. What have we got here? Oh, just a barrel. Uh, oh, well, that was the way in the world. So, well, I guess one here. Let's just check it again in case I missed something. But I'm pretty sure this is not open from this side. Yeah. Not unless there have to be a switch hiding in the uh, building here that I missed. What is possible? Switch? Hiding a switch anywhere? Around the bed? No. the table. No. Oh uh, dear. So I'm stuck up here unless I go back by the zombies, which is fine. I've got two fire arrows left and one of the zombies is... only one of them still kind of semi-alive and he might not even wake up. If he does, I can just finish him off. Okay, this way. Got the two tunnels confused, but that's alright. So, all I'm trying to do is find the last cult members that are still alive in order to kill them. And I think I know where I need to get to go in order to do that. Yeah, hey, over here. Oh. They didn't kill you. What's that? Alright, um, so, where am I going now? Now, I seem to remember somebody chasing me this way. And I don't know if they came back again. Oh, there they are. So there's one of the cult members that's still alive. Let's go back to my tree of safety. Here, you coward. This way! Oh, 
Who are you running to? Where did you go? Huh? Where did you run off to? Oh, I see. <gasps> as well. That's a new key that I've not seen before. Interesting. I don't know where it goes to. And that's still not all cult members. Alright. But there were two people chasing me down there, so let's see if anyone else is down that way. If not, I'm going to have to do a lot of hunting for cult members. <laughs> oh, I hear somebody. Yep, alright. Do I have a flashbang? No. I'm gonna make him run away from me as well, because he's fast. Scared, huh? We yep. have an intruder! somebody in which one? Did I save after the first one? Or is he still out here? Oh, okay, that was him. Alright. Uh, did I explore down here, by the way? No, I didn't, did I? There are two more guys down here. Alright. Leave the other guy to uh, figure out what he wants to do. Oh, put up with the dramatic noises here and slaughter these fellows. Oh. Yeah, right there, Garrett. How do you know it's me? Just poke your head out. Any idea I'll end what it for we you do quickly, like. guests? The other guy with my sword. Alright, two more down. There's still the one running around upstairs. What have we got here? Training dummy, some shackles. Bed rolls and a pick, shovel, and uh, something broken. And uh, I'm not sure what those are. Door. Looks important. Oh, look at all this loot! Fire arrows, gold, and broadheads. Is this another body part? I wonder. 
full real quick. So it's not explained what these body parts are about. It's possibly on a different difficulty level. But it was important. I don't know. We have a well. A well. There's a ladder. Righty ho! So, what's that over there? Let's zoom in and have a look. That is this must be the sword of Saint Edgar. Uh, it's not actually on my objective list in this difficulty. No. But uh, you know, I have Riveros. Quite a lot of them. I think is worth some kind of dramatic Indiana Jones esque no time for Let's go get that sword. Jump. One route to the next. Carefully. <laughs> Try not to get stuck on the edge. What's up? Where can I... Where can I walk? How odd. How very odd. Intentional or a glitch? It must be intentional. It must be. It must be there's something I need to do. To uh, get to it. Yeah, it's definitely, definitely an invisible wall. Oh, that was it. Just a bit of fire. All right. I have Saint Edgar's sword. Is it on my own? Not really sure what difference it does. Maybe it does more damage. Who knows? Not that it would really matter at this point. Oh, that was close. I'm not getting these red barrows back, that's for sure. Well, I could cut this one back. Alright. Well, that was worth exploring a little, I guess. So. Is our friend back up here patrolling? So where did he go? Uh, have I been here? Yes, I've been here. Of course, this leads into Lady Wilson Face's chambers. Uh, sorry, Captain Wilson Face's chambers. Silly. I'm going to stick the dogs on you when I... We have an intruder! Oh, he's running away. Try to deal with running away. Yay! Great shot. 
Straight through the bars. Haha. Kinda still not all of them. Where are they all hiding? Alright, uh, we're back down in the underground fortress, and I found out one thing I was missing. These body parts and things are very important. It wasn't like drop the rocks in these holes. It was meant to have body parts and things in these holes. Let's just pick them all up again. Alright, so what does it say? It says, this body be dead and cold. Mine arms, leaden with the hard earth. Right, where's the arms? Aha. The body be dead and cold. Well, what is cold, right? Where's the body? Where's the body? Yeah. Aha. And mine eyes, they have turned from the light. Uh, well, there's the light, and here is his eyes. And that has opened. This doorway! That's about the most complicated and disgusting switch for a secret passage I've ever heard of. Um, emphasis on the disgusting. Yeah, let's carry these dead and rotting body parts around. And uh, use those to open our secret door. Yeah. And this looks like. Is that just windows or is it traps? That appears to be just windows. Okay. What have we here? Another bedroom. This must be the necromancer's place because uh, no one else would be so spooky. And he has another secret door. Look at that. Switch somewhere. There's his mask. Ah, uh, apparently he's made of gold. Here's his laboratory. He's got a speed potion. Take that. Probably not have a chance to use it anymore. I think I've done all the running around I'm gonna do. And a throne! In fact, that he's stolen Lord Baffert's throne. And there's his, must be his switch for a secret passage. Yep. Alright, he'll be down there somewhere. Dark. It's pitch dark. What's going on here? Ah, I don't like the sound of this at all. He is dead, we've killed all the cult members. Now all we have to do is get back out to the sewers with life and limb intact. Where are the sewers? Well, life and limb intact, uh, well, you know, I think we lost about three of our four limbs, like giving our, uh, wow, walls full of, full of skulls. Given our hit points, we must have lost at least three of our limbs, but uh, you know, we're still alive. Still running. Can't see our legs, but we never could, so that's alright. Uh, so we just have to get back out of here, finally. So. I was just misled by the complexity of that uh, secret passage lock. Is this the sewers? I don't know. I'll just go back out to the city streets so if I can see if that's enough. If it finishes on the way there, that'll be fine. Um, yeah. Uh, where was the front door? Out this way. Did 
Um. There we go. All right. So let's try going back to the building we came from and see if that's sufficient. If it wants me to get somewhere else, I'll be uh, a little bit annoying. Also, this all go back to where you came from. It's not a very interesting objective, really. No, no, great. Uh, get back out of the fortress, which I've done, and into the sewers. Well, where's the sewers? There were no sewers. I found no sewers here. Don't tell me he wants me to go back to that passage under the well that I couldn't get into. Or is it other sewers that it's talking about? I mean, the map says waterways, but I never found them. North, so they're west. <laughs> and not over here, because I could see the edge of the map from over here, right? See? There's nothing down there. I could go down the side of this and get stuck permanently, but that would not really be a good idea. Where does it want me to finish? To go? Well, I'll try the well. I'll try that well outside the fortress because it possibly means that. It was had a passageway that I couldn't unlock, but maybe it was an end of mission kind of passageway. But if it doesn't mean that, then I have no idea what it wants. God, no. I think I've still got some rope arrows, right? Otherwise, I would be quite screwed. Um, didn't think I shut the door, but okay. This way. Back down. I mean, it's odd to say. It seems very odd to say to escape. Don't go back out. You know, stay in the underground secret place where nobody knows where it is and where it goes. Uh, you know, I guess sometimes you do want to escape a different way than you came in, because that way no one will be able to follow you. Um, that's just not true. But in this case, nobody will be able to follow me or anything because they're all dead. Every single one of them murdered horribly. Okay, it was up to that. Let me save here because I know I can't get back up from this lift or back down again if there's a wrong. I guess I can run around the well and stuff. Alright, so the well was this way or was this the undead? Body. This was. I think this is the well. Yes, this is the well. Alright. Is this where you want me to go? Game? It's a place that otherwise has no purpose. Because it's not sewers to me, it's just an underwater passageway. Well, alright. That is it. That was the Cult of the Resurrection, uh, who are now, unfortunately, the Cult of the Quite Dead and Massacred. There is two hours and one minute, and excluding deaths, of course. We found every single piece of loot. That's very unusual for me. I don't tend to do that. Um, I tend to miss quite a lot. And uh, innocents killed some. Oh, okay. I guess that was the two, the two in the kitchen, maybe. Others killed twenty-nine. Maybe we didn't need to kill those two in the kitchen. But never mind. We did. Um, so they won't be making any more food for the cultists either. Damage deal 945, damage deal 19, and we almost died. Alright, that was Cult of the Resurrection. Thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you back here for the next mission.